I chose the energy technology program so I can go into almost any field that I would like as in for cars or industrial electronics it's very you can you can go into plenty of different fields with this with this degree that I'm getting right now that I get it's not just pen, pen and paper learning it's actual implementing on trainers and whatnot what I like the most about the energy technology program is that we get to do hands-on work. Not only learning class time, it's not just lecture, it's not just theory. We get to actually practice, apply what we learn, and I feel like that's super important for us because you can't just find that anywhere. Uh, well, I definitely know now, and it's really been cemented through the course, that I want to do something uh, related to technology. So uh, this course has just really sparked that in me, and I'm going forward to whatever college I'm going to. Uh, one of the best decisions I've ever made to come <coughs> to OC Techs. OC Tech and dual credit students, uh, while they're doing their high school uh, degree in consequence, so they can come and uh, take some courses uh, at Odessa College in INE department. Um, as long as they finish their um, high school diploma, they can get their associate degree as well. Well, the demand right now is challenging for the industry because there's like 60% of automation workers to be retired in the next five years and there's not enough uh, personnel to supply for that. A uh, new employee would be making close to 22 to 23 dollars an hour. Uh, after a year you can make up to 26 or 27 and even more. The world is turning to automation now and pretty much 80 percent of all jobs will be related to automation one way or another in the next five years.